In this video, we'll show a number in three plus decimal places without rounding uh, using the floor function. So, uh, what, how this is different? How is this different from the previous video? In the previous video, what we did was we converted the number into a string, and then we manipulated that string. In this video, though, um, this this is how we will perform directly on the integer, which might be more straightforward and more efficient. But then it also comes back to what you want to do in your program. So um, again, I just want to say thank you to the um, the person who posted this comment on my channel on Python 59 saying, can you please share the same in C? So we did the same for this video in C, uh, but then that inspired me to do this one in both Python and in C. So thanks for that. All right, so uh, let's just see what we have. Let's just compile and run this. So we've basically just got the number displayed and we can even say to how many decimal places we'd like it to display the number. So if I run again, it will print this number to, to, to three decimal places, but there's rounding involved. So it rounded the value. We don't want it to do that. So we want to use the floor function, the floor function. So floor, and what floor does is you want to give it the value that you want to truncate. What it will do is it will return the largest integer that is less than or equal to our input value. So that's our input value, which is we've declared it as value. So let's put that into um, a... Um, a variable called truncated value and let's print it out the truncated number is truncated value let's see what we get yeah so like we said what it does is it returns the largest integer that is less than or equal to so the largest integer that is larger, uh, sorry, that is less than or equal to our original input, which is this value here. But we also want it to display those three digits. So what we're going to do is just add some math here and feel free to increase or decrease the number of zeros to change the precision. So I just want to say that my comment in the Python version wasn't probably the best, but I hope you got what I meant. So I kind of tried to improve that comment. Um, yeah, so um, let's do some math. Uh, if we multiply this value by 1000, let's see what we get. Next, if we divide this number by 1000, it will... Um, so after we get this value being floored, and then we divide that by 1000, we'll get those three digits. So if you want it to be four decimal places, you'll just add a zero. That's what I was trying to say. <laughs> All right, so let's uh, compile and run. That's it, there we go. So we've got our value uh, that is shown in three decimal places, but without rounding, and we've only used the floor function. Remember to include this library, math.h, because it was already included. I did that before we started, but don't forget to actually add this as well. Okay, that's it. So I hope this was helpful. Thank you so much. Please keep your questions coming. Um, I'm more than happy to take your questions and turn them into videos if you find that helpful. And I'll see you in the future ones. Future ones, yeah.